Расскажите, пожалуйста, а есть ли такие сознания, Tell us, please, are there consciousnesses out there born to exist on the edge between the world? Road-like consciousness, bridge-like consciousness, the essence of which is to connect the light and the dark. The consciousness that cannot be unequivocally associated with one particular site because extreme would mean a certain death to them. Those are the peacemakers, the guides, people one is drawn to while being at the very peak of transformation. These people are like interstitial fluid that connects all parts of the organism with one another. Do such consciousnesses exist? And if they do, where can one get more information on it? Yes, these consciousnesses do exist. You describe them beautifully, colleague. Thank you for this question. And they can be found, as you said, at the very peak of your transformation, almost anywhere. Usually, it happens that we meet such people as if by the will of gods, when two consciousnesses are truly ready to unite. But even mere mortals get lucky sometimes. These people, just like the two-faced Janus, stand on the edge between the worlds, looking in different directions. One stares into the dark world, the other into the world of light. And if we conditionally assume that the living find themselves within a spot of light, then sometimes this face turns towards them, and that's when it can be seen. He is a border guard and can only be seen by the effects his face creates in this world while being positioned on the edge between the worlds. Namely, the writers, who instead of turning their face to the dark, decided to turn it towards the light, towards people, giving everything they're going through while standing on the edge, giving it straight out there, into the spot of light. They are the great mystics, great writers, rarely film directors, cinematographers, they are great poets, more seldom theatre directors. They are great prophets and rarely mystics. And teachers who are impelled to work with people. Sometimes they are born, marvelously insane, and people who live within the spot of light perceive them as such, as the crazy ones. The schizophrenic art, the Portuguese writer Saramago, that writes one-page long sentences, Pure schizophrenia. Any doctor who opens this text would confirm it straight away. Yes, that's my client. Mine, mine for sure. The writers who unveil the facets that can only be seen in the dark, only in black color these facets are revealed. Those writers are able to look in both directions, but they share their knowledge with those who are present in the light. There are also those who, on the contrary, look only into the dark and they can never be seen unless you come close to this edge on very rare occasions. Suddenly, you will see a regular person in his true dark side. There are people like that. You will surely find them if you keep searching or if you suddenly become ready for it. The world of magic itself will lead you to this person in order for you to resonate with one another. These people are guides that will simply take you from one reality into another. It is enough to read a book written by a master of this kind. And after turning the last page, you understand that you suddenly found yourself in another reality. It may, even if only slightly, differ from the one you were in before starting the book or before your initial contact with this person. Sometimes the transitions can be very significant, the world changes entirely, and sometimes very slightly.
But nonetheless, the vector of time starts to move in a completely different direction. And this means that your destiny changes as well. Because destiny is directly connected to the temporal vector in which its program is being implemented. These people do exist. They can also be called mages, but these are mages who were born to be this way. We often spoke about the fact that it would be a wrong statement, a very wrong statement, to say that one must be born a mage. And if you weren't so lucky, you should forever forget about it, about this path. But it isn't really so. And this would only apply to these type of guides, to these two-faced beings, who are born one in a million, or maybe even rarer than that. А может быть даже еще и реже.